Welcome to the vaults, and this is where we do straight up coin collecting. I am Tripwire, and this month is donation month. Uh, in November, I donate to St. Jude's uh, Hospital over here. And what it is, is like anything that I want to keep when I'm doing coin collecting, I actually have to buy it off myself. So when we're going to be going through everything today, like if there's something that I want to keep, I got to put up the cash value for it. That would be the donation portion of the vault. And, well, if you guys want to check out Straight Up Metal Detecting, I'll explain how I do that one, too. But, anyhow, seeing as how we're going to be donating everything, or at least trying to, um, we're going to go through everything that we're going to do today. And, uh, first we're going to do a mystery bag of coins from Chemical X. Maybe there's a Bob Ross in here. I don't know. We'll find out. Uh, we're going to do heads or tails. Yes, so we're going to do heads or tails over here. Two pennies. I know they're identical. I can't help that all the time. We are definitely going to be doing a few more dimes, you know, because they're kind of small and they're a pain in the butt. Rep battle. So again, we got stripes versus solids. So I do that off camera to save time. And just to make sure that I have to donate something, just to make sure... I got uh, some more wheat pennies, so this is a guaranteed donation. Who knows, what, what if we pull out a few of these and they actually turn out to be like uh, uh, $100 pennies? I, I got to put up the $100. <laughs> because I got, when I keep it, I got to buy it off of me. Um, we're going to go over the coins I found over this last week of coin collecting. And of course, you know, we can't have a show unless we do worldwide coinage. And last but not least, we got a search for silver. Yes, so we got a little half dollar roll here, and we're going to be looking at that. But first and foremost, we're going to see what type of pop we're going to be drinking today. I have them all lined up in a row, and I asked Chemical X to pick a number, and he picked number eight. L let me put it to you this way. I got a chaser. That's going to tell you how bad this is going to be. And I'm telling you one thing right now. I am opening it now. Because I know this is not going to be pretty. This is not going to be pretty by a long shot. Dirt. Soda. Yeah, you're probably thinking, why, why why do I do this? Well, if I want to, it's just a fun thing to do. You know, try it out. You know, you know it's going to taste like crap, but, you know, it's just kind of luck of the draw. You know, why go in there and get all your favorite flavors, you know? So try something, like, really disgusting <laughs> just to see how bad it is, you know? Just, uh, I hate life. I really do. You know what? I hate to say this. It's actually pretty darn good. So you take a chance on something and uh, it might actually pay off. It's actually pretty good, but I'm going to have like a few more swigs of this and then we're going to get set up. All right, cool. Yeah, you know, Grant, when you do take a swallow, like towards the end, like right when the last part goes down, it actually does taste kind of grainy. I was expecting it to be worse, but I'm still not going to buy it again. But it, it, it was just worth taking a chance, so that's what we did. All right, uh, we're going through Chemical X's bag of coins that he gave me. Uh, it's all this pocket change you get from work and everything. So I'm going to look over see what we can find. And I'll show you how we do digging the given here. Let me put this down a little bit. There we go. Um, is that as high as it goes? That's as high as it goes. Was that 1980? Sorry, I'm screwing with the camera too much. I think that's a 1980. So that that's copper right there. So I gotta put up a penny because I wanna keep it. What was that? 95. Nope. A little dime here. Was that 2016? Nope. Let's go back a bit. There we go. This is one got a 84. Don't need that. What the world is this? Something ugly, and I don't need it. Quarter time. What do we got? 82. Nope. Nope. Gotta flip it over the right way, right? Oh, no, we don't need that one. 2017. I don't know where the heck this glare is coming from. Beats me. Uh, you know what? I'm going to hold that one just because. Where is this glare coming from? I got the lights up. The normal. Oh, wrong way. Was that 97? I'm going to have to. After this, I'm going to have to stop and adjust something. 91. This glare's not good at all. 2016, no. Let's see. 94, I think. This is a uh, Buffalo. No, it's Kansas. Nope, don't need that. Is that 90 something or another? Don't need that. 77? Yep, 77. Uh, 80, what? 84? Nope. 
Glad I didn't grab a lot of these coins, that's for sure. Um, let's see, what's this? Uh, all I know is that we don't need it. What was that, 67? I hold the 60s. All right, I gotta figure out where this glare is coming from. Give me a second here. And the glare problem is fixed. I was sitting a little bit too close to one of the lights. Anyhow, heads or tails, what do we got? Heads. All right, we're gonna do heads. That's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna set you aside. I'm gonna try you out next week. Let me pull this up a tad. There's still a bit of a glare. I just got to keep the coins over in one certain area. Okay, so let's see what we got here. We're going to open this bad boy up. Hopefully we get some good stuff. One second. There you go. And open. What do we got? There, that. Yeah, before my, uh, my dad passed away, and he never uh, really donated to any charities except, except for St. Jude's. And... Uh, I was thinking, I need a some a charity I wanted to do for him. I'm just going to carry on the tradition that my dad started, so that's why I'm doing St. Jude. It's cool, I like it. Uh oh, we got copper right off the bat. There's a penny. I gotta donate a penny. Yeah, I keep it. 94. Can't tell if that's an 82, I think. I don't need that. Coming up. Is that 73? This is as high as it goes. Screwing with the camera a lot, I apologize. Yeah, it's a 73. Uh, 193. I'm off today. Okay, there we go. Don't need that. Don't need that one. 2015. 73. I gotta donate. 17D. 2000. Is that 14? And this is just ugly. Can't even tell if that was copper value or not. Speaking of copper value, I'm going to double check this one. Let me see. Looks nice. I'm going to check the mint mark on that one for some reason. It looked like it was almost an S. It's an 83. 60s. Okay, we'll take that. And we won't take that because I can already tell I don't want it. I shouldn't say that because of the copper value, because I do collect pennies for copper value. 2017P, there we go. Another donation. Donate! Let's see, 2002, nope. 2000. Nope. Nope, 2018. Nope. You guys been finding anything cool? Let me know in the comments below. Yes, I do read the comments. If you guys got any suggestions for the show, let me know. I'm willing to try out anything. If you guys got any topics, because next week's the topic week. If you guys want me to research a topic for you, I'll be more than happy to. 84. Nope. I do have a topic in mind, but if somebody else wants to throw in a topic, that would be awesome, because I'd rather do theirs than mine. 2011. 2002, I think. Nope. I think copper. Hi, copper. No, that's a wheat penny. There we go. So there, that's definitely a donation. I wasn't ready for that. That's definitely a donation. I'm going to have to look up the value of that one. Whatever the value is, that's why I put it up. I, I didn't check the date too well. It looked like it was in the 40s. So I think it's about a nickel. Yeah, I donated a nickel on that, I think. Canadian, there's a donation. Thank you, Canadian. 76. Nope, 2001. What are you? 68. Nope. 84. Nope. 2001. 70. 76, donate, donate. <laughs> you guys are going to get so flipping sick of me saying donate. Believe it or not, I watch this one. I'll, I'll talk about it next time we get into the when we move on. See, copper value. I got to keep it. 73 copper. I don't care what it looks like. It's the value. That I can't even tell. Yeah. Nope, it. Last one. Last penny out of the roll. What is that? That's 91. We don't need that. Okie dokie. Let's see what we got next on the list. It's going to be some dimes. 
I'm not going to do a lot of dimes because they're really, really small. And I usually don't find stuff in dimes anyhow. So we're just going to grab like a few of them. Come on. Come on out. Get out of the bag. Get out of the bag. Screw it. <laughs> there, here we go. We got some right here. This will work. Okay, what do we have? Uh, 90. Nope, oh, that ain't it. What right here? 2002. If I see, if I see a 2019, I'll, I'll grab it. And I'll put 10 cents up on that. 90. I wonder if I hope I get some 60s, because I will donate on the 60s. I don't know why. I don't know what my fascination is with collecting 60s coins. Where is that, 70? Yeah, 74. Whoops. Sorry about that. I'm going to move a little quicker. Nope. 2004. Nope. 80. Alright, going up. Another 80. Come on, at least 160 would be nice, please. That's 70. Yeah, it's a 75. 91. I don't know. 2001. There we go. Woohoo, this might be one. Is it? 2017. Nope. Is that a 60? That's a 1999. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how I got that mixed up. 70. Is that 72? Yeah, 92, 72, something like that. Nope, that's 90. Get back here. What do you got here? Um, nope. And last one here. Uh, 1990s. Nope, that ain't cutting it. So let's see, we're going to move on to the rap battle. How about that? I, I do this off camera just to save time. So we got Stripes versus Solid. When I come back, we'll figure out which one has the best coins in it. Make a guess. Who do you want to win? Choose. All right, here's the rap battle. And it definitely looked like uh, the Stripes are going to, this one's going to win over here. I found three coins out there. I know it looks. I know that that one looks like crap. But what are you gonna do? But I only found one out of here that I like. So, but either way, for me, that is uh, twenty cents. I gotta donate. So, because I'm keeping all of them. All right. Um, we're gonna look for some wheat pennies. I already pulled them out of the bag right before I turned the camera on. And there's a special surprise for everybody. <laughs> Get to that in a second. First, let's see what this one is. Found something I didn't think I was gonna find. I get to share with you guys. So I'm happy about that. Okay, um, yeah, 51S. Now you gotta look up S's. Lovely. Okay. I'm gonna save that one for last two. Um, 40? I believe that's a 40. Got this one here. Boom. Oh, upside down. What's that? 31? Faded. 35. Okay, 35. That's cool. So, that, I know that one's definitely, uh, probably a nickel. That's 49. I don't think that's a nickel. I think that's a penny. But I'll check it out anyways. Is that 35? Oh, I love those little chops on the bottom. Thanks a lot, guys. Yeah, these are all S's. So, that's a 35. That one's cool as heck. Uh, what do we got here? 51? I think that's only a penny right now, to be honest with you. Um, let's see. 51 again, I believe. Let me double check that. It's upside down. Dude. 51. Yep. Got two more here. What do we have here? We got, uh, is that 28 or 38? I have to look under the microscope. I can't really see it. You guys ready for this? You guys are ready for this? Boom. Steel penny. Got a steel penny out of the bag. I am thrilled with that, so I'm going to have to look that up because I know that's going to be like, I think they're going for like a quarter or something, but I am happy to find a steel penny. Totally awesome. All right, now we're going to go through the coins I found over this last week. I'll set it up, and I'll let you know what we got. Okay, these are the coins I found over this last week of coin collecting. And, yes, this also gets donated for sure. Uh, I found a wheat penny. I believe that was in the 30s. Got a 2009. We got a P, 2017 P, 2019, just because I like them. Got three. Sorry about that. Got three uh, 2004s, one 2005, a 1960s dime, and three quarters. Uh, two of them are uh, 2019, and the other one, I just think it looks really, really cool. All right, let's move on to Worldwide Coinage. All right, here's how you do this. For those of you that have never seen this show before, 
Uh, what is I pick four foreign coins at random, and I research them, and I'll tell you what I found next week. So let's see. You got one dude. Is that a Canadian? Not a Canadian. That's another Canadian? No, it's not a Canadian. Okay, that's cool. Let's do that one. That one. This one. And uh, screw it. We'll do that. Oh, two. Let's do the ugly one. We'll do the ugly one. These are going to be the four coins that I am going to research next week. And I'll let you know. But let's go over the coins that I found last week. That's a good idea. I think so. They're kind of interesting. Some of them might be a repeat, but hey, it's going to happen. What do we have here? And this is a... Uh, this is from France. It's a 1972. This is kind of cool. This is a half a franc. <laughs> That's cool. It's made out of nickel and in very good condition. It's worth seven cents. In extra fine, it's 33 cents. So, yeah, that's a cool one. I like that one. Half a franc. <laughs> I don't think I, I think that's the only half coin I've ever seen. This one I like. I love the edges. But this one here, we got ourselves a uh, five peso. And this is from 1985. Mexico, it is made out of brass, and fair, fine conditions, uh, 22 cents, extra fine, 36 cents, so that's a good thing, I like that, that's a cute, that's a cool little coin, I dig that one, that's neat, uh, well, coming up next, we got this, look, grab two at one time, can't do that, boom, what do we got, come here, Ooh, star, one penny, this is from the Bahamas, and it's a 1992 one cent, Copper plated zinc is what this one is. It's also kind of ugly. <laughs> In extra fine condition, it was worth 66 cents. So that's interesting to know. And let's see, last but not least, we got this guy over here. We've seen him a lot of times. We've seen this one before, but it's, it's, we do it anyways, right? And no, it's not a Canadian. There we go. It's uh, from the United Kingdom. This is Elizabeth II, uh, 1971 bronze. In good condition, it's worth six cents. AU condition, 20 cents. All right, let's stop screwing around. I know what you want, and I know what I want. So, we're might as well just do it. It's that time. Ooh, look, writing. Let's read what the writing says. Um, save. Okay. PL. 10D. 10P. Okay. So, P. What's that? Say? Is, is it? Oh, that says P and D. It's about to say. I don't think that they had O at that time. Uh Scribble a little bit. I think that's someone's name, to be honest with you. But yeah, let's go through this roll. Maybe we'll find silver. I don't know. But uh, we're about to find out. Come on. Because, I mean, what it says on there may not actually be the thing. So I don't have to pull it up here. Yeah, because those said uh, 1997. Wrong way. Wrong way. 3D. Let's go to potato up. Yeah. So already we know that one lies. That's not that's not what it is. Uh, what's that? Nineteen ninety three. Yep, ninety three. Ninety three. Eighty six. Eighty six. Uh, nope. 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 Come on, be something nice. Nope. Uh, I'll take a bicentennial. Nope. Nope. Oh, the search for silver. How it tries my patience. Nope. That ain't coming either. Boom. No boom. Yeah, so somebody just re-rolled it in that wrapper. Nope. Down to the last four here. Uh, 88. I don't see any that I even want in my collection right now. 97. Probably turn these in again. I mean, I'm going to keep this one. I'll keep that one. So 97 looks pretty good, so yeah. Well, that's it. Uh, we didn't exactly find any silver again, but at least we found one 50-cent piece. All right, there you go. Uh, just another end of the vault, and I am Tripwire, and we do got uh, coins that I'm going to buy off myself, and I want to keep them, so I got to put up the money for them. I'll let you know how much everything was next week. Um, really quick follow-up on one thing. The first couple of swigs were not that bad, but the more you start drinking this crap, it gets it gets worse with every sip. It really does. It gets really bad with every sip. So uh, it was worth a shot. You know how many people can say they drink that? So I'm just gonna stick with the greatest of all, or second greatest of all, Pepsi. All right, I'll see you all next week on Friday for some more vault coin collecting. And remember, if you're a coin collector, you 
are never broke. We'll see you next Friday. Later.